is this on? Can you guys hear me? Can you hear me? Um, because literally, I did a video this morning, uploaded it, and apparently I was muted the entire time. And I saw the comments, and it was plenty of people saying, Clan, I'm sure you're saying some good points, my boy, but I can't hear a word because your mic is muted. I want some Are we having fun yet? You guys do not know how frustrating it is to do a video, a whole video, all right? Clean straight through, make some great points, and it's doing good numbers just to find out that the, the, the video is useless. So let's go ahead and talk about this, all right? I'll try to rehash some of the things that I talked about in that video, but I'm actually happy uh, that the mic did mess up because there's some extra news, okay? And it seems as if maybe possibly, it's probably some speculation that campaign isn't happy coming to the Spurs. So we'll, we'll talk about that. So let's go ahead and dive into clanthemerchfan.com. If you guys want to support the channel, link in the description. Um, I'm a little, actually, I'll be honest with you guys. I'm, I'm pretty caught up. Like there's just a few uh, more orders um, that I'm catching up on. I think about four or five. Uh, so if you didn't get a tracking number, uh, I'm sorry, just, just be, be patient with me. Um, but I'll get to yours next, but it's pretty nice. So if you guys want to support, you want to dive in and, and help your boy out. Hey, please do, man. It's some fresh merch, man. It's some fresh merch. Ask anybody that got it. It's pretty nice. All right. So where's my, where's my thing? Oh, here it is. All right. So the San Antonio Spurs trading for campaign, a second round pick and cash. Um, that's what the Phoenix Suns is is giving the San Antonio Spurs. And let, let's be honest here, okay? I, I'm I'm making the assumption. Well, I don't have to make the assumption. That, that's what I said in the last video or the video that was muted the entire time. Um, <laughs> but campaign, it, it is it is going. It, it's set in stone now. Uh, he will sign with the Spurs. At least that's what it seems. Um, the Spurs have already released Stevens. And I wasn't completely sure with who stays and who goes, but it has begun today. And it seems like campaigns, one of those pieces that will stay. So the Spurs are absolutely killing it. Okay. As you can see here, shout out to Tom Petrini on this one. What the Spurs have given up this summer, five second round picks. That's a lot of picks clan. Ah, uh, that's, that's a lot wrong. Um, actually it's only one second round pick because in actuality, the Spurs basically gave up nothing. The five second round picks converted to four second round picks and a first round pick swap cash campaign. Lamar Stevens, who just got waived, Reggie Bullock and Seti Osman, in which we're still waiting on news on Osman. I, I don't think we heard anything yet, but I hope he stays because I really like Osman. Um, but the Spurs have a bunch of players on expiring contracts, a total of about 25 a million so the spurs have absolutely killed it so basically all they gave up was one uh second round uh pick for all of this goodness and i'm i'm very impressed by that um also completely off topic look at your boy wimby he shaved i i don't think this was the, like i didn't have to do a whole video on this i just want to show you that he he shaved his head guys i'm really upset about my video um earlier anyways um you know so cam all right okay so the spurs getting cam or whatever all good but this is what made me a little worried um so as you can see here he reposted hoop central that said cam Payne dropped 54 or 54 points at aebl uh today and then he reposted that and he said go spurs he left off the other go okay so obviously he's not a real spur he doesn't know what he's talking about but that's an upside down happy face okay if you know anything about the upside down happy face that means you're not happy and it, it seems like he's a little he's a little irritated but i i thought about it my initial reaction was wow bro you don't even want to be here uh, another one i don't care get rid of this guy but then i thought about it and i said no what it is he reposted this to show that he what his worth is and he still got traded and that's that's the reaction go spurs i guess you know it's kind of one of those things i also went through his twitter and he's pretty short with everything that he posts he's just one of those players that's kind of cryptic so it just is what it is it, it, it i don't think he meant anything by it and i think he is or he will be happy uh to be with the spurs now as far as cam how do i feel about the 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 pickup well i think that he's a day one contributor i'll tell you that much and honestly and this is going to sound really mean and i don't mean this in a mean way i think that he is a placeholder for the type of player that we want he's like a c version of the player that i want the san antonio spurs to have and what type of player is that that's a player that's crafty a player that can create his own shot 
and a player that can contribute as far as playmaking, facilitating, and all that jazz. He has all of that um, that that package uh, offensively, and I think he is a day one contributor. And as we can see here, I think it's yeah, it's blocking for you guys. But last season he averaged 10.3 points per game and 4.5 rebounds. Percentage pretty doggone good from three at 30 about 37 percent. Um, from three so he is a day one contributor and I think that he's a great placeholder for Wimby because the Spurs are searching for that type of player like they need that guard at point guard that can do a little bit of everything we need our Jamal Murray um, in, a, in a sense I know Jamal Murray isn't you know necessarily you know, that but you get what I'm saying like we need our Jamal Murray to our Jokic and that's 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 just the fact of the matter okay and Cam I think that he's a perfect placeholder for that just so we can um, see what that's like so Wimby can get uh, accustomed to him and I think that he fits with the team perfectly now the question would be for Spurs fans in particular does getting campaign mean that Blake Wesley is obsolete um, are you taking away all of his minutes I do think that this chips into his minutes I don't think Trey Jones has much to worry about but I definitely think Blake Wesley is gonna is gonna chip into his Malachi Branham I think he'll be fine I know they experimenting in the summer league having him run point guard obviously in college he was also he also could run point guard like he was a fine facilitator but i would much rather him just be in that shooting guard uh, uh spot and not have to worry about facilitation even though the spurs have dabbled in it a little bit so it should be a pretty fun season um and i hate to bring this up okay i just have to be honest it, and, it, and it stings it's fine because we got Wimby, we got sohan we got guys that are actually normal and not weirdos but i will say primo my boy Primo, why, man? Why? Jeez, I hope he gets the help that he needs. And, you know, he, he has a successful career somewhere else, probably away from basketball. I think it's just too much power. <laughs> I think I think you have too much power being an NBA player, but hopefully maybe he'll he'll be successful in some other venture. But geez, man, he is the exact archetype that I think the Spurs need. This is like a C plus version of the archetype that the Spurs uh, are going to be looking for, and what's going to ultimately complete our puzzle. You get you a guard that's a combo guard that can score, that can uh, uh, facilitate, play make good around the pick and rolls, can play some defense, and you set. If they can be a star, you are set. Um, and I think that's the main goal right now for the Spurs. And then you kind of build around that. But gosh, it is so frustrating. But as it stands right now, it's fine. I do like campaign and I think he's a day one contributor. I don't think there's any way or reality in which he goes on this team and he does not play. Um, so yeah, I, I think he gets minutes day one. So good pickup. Spurs are killing it in the off season. As always, this is how we usually do it. We're very quiet. We're really, you know, underneath the sheets. I don't, I don't know why, I don't know why I said that. I, I don't, I don't, I shouldn't have said that. Um, but you know what I'm saying. So overall, I'm happy. Good job, Spurs. And uh, that's all I really gotta say. And, and Cam, it's it's go Spurt. Cam. 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 It's go Spurs. Go, my boy. Not just go Spurt. What are you doing? What are you? What are you doing? Anyways, I'll give it to you guys later. You want to support the channel? As always, clanthemerchfan.com or become a patron of YouTube member only. Oh wait, wait. Shut up. Wait. Okay, I got I got to tell you guys something. Um, I completely forgot about this. Um, so what we're gonna do, and I probably need to start bringing this up in other videos as well. Uh, so I have something going on. Sorry, I'm going to my channel because I'm going to the community post. Um, so what we're gonna do is this upcoming Friday, I am going to host the Amazon Prime Movie Watch Party. Okay, it's gonna be a lot of fun. And I only have 100 slots, but I don't think we'll fill up all 100, but who knows? Um, you guys are pretty active. Uh, so I'm going to send out the link on Friday, um, probably early on in the day. Uh, I know I put in here like after an hour or so, I'll send out to the rest of people, but I'll probably send it early in the day to only Patreon and YouTube members so they can get in first, so they can have their slots um, and so they can have their links. So they'll have the links pretty early, and then at some point, uh, I guess whenever I open it up or, or whatnot, sometime when we go live that night, um, you guys can go in and, and we can uh, watch a movie. As far as the movies that we will be watching, I wrote it down somewhere. Where the heck did I? Oh, my God. Is it gone? No, I got it here. Um, so I got a few movies here. Suggestions. They can only be Amazon movies and, unless we went on a different platform. But I think everyone basically has Amazon. But I have A Beautiful Mind, Jackass Forever, Perk of Being a, a Wallflower, uh something called mural i don't know what that is 
um, and Lika Rice uh, Pizza, which I've been wanting to see that for a while. So we, we got some pretty good films on there. Um, Jack is more of just a fun one, but we, we got some films on there. So uh, I'll do a poll pretty soon as well, and we'll pick uh, what movie we want to watch uh, on Friday. But just letting you guys know, just, just, just be on the lookout for that. Um, if you're wondering how you're going to get the link as a YouTube member or a Patreon member, um, how you get the link first, you'll get the link first because I can make posts that are only for YouTube members and I can make posts, um, on Patreon as well. So that's just how we'll do it. But anyways, uh, that's all I had to say. I'll give it to you guys later till next time. Bye.